What's up, y'all? This is Ann Glizzy and this is Bob Sun TV. And today we got Charleston White versus Ann Glizzy in the boxing match. All right, so Charleston White, they asked me something about him on Say Cheese in the interview. Sean Carter asked me. I remind him of Charleston White because we both do numbers on the internet. We be going off and I told him I smacked out Charleston White. Don't compare me to no Charleston White. Charleston White. It's one of the hottest guys on the end. He openly hot. Like, he don't care. He'll tell you. He'll tell you. Like, so just stay away from him. But long story short, Charleston White made a whole Instagram video out there. I said that, telling me how he going to kill me. Show me how he going to do it with a knife, all this. So we was going back and forth. I guess it went away. Because he told me, man, I ain't, you ain't got no followers. I ain't getting into it with you. You ain't even got no YouTube page. At this time, I ain't even had no YouTube. I just started a YouTube channel. I got 50,000 subscribers since the time. From the time he told me that to now, I got 50,000 subscribers. I just started a YouTube the day that he told me that. But I had a page with a blue check and more followers than Charleston White. I would have more followers than Charleston White if I still had my page. It's like, I don't know where he came from, why he think he's somebody. Like, how long does... First of all, I'm me. I've been in the pavement. I've been here forever, bro. You just popped up. In these years, like you came out of nowhere. I ain't come out of nowhere. People know my history and all that. Nobody know your history. Them guys disappeared. I can tell you a couple guys before you. What's his name? Uh, boot game. Now he's John, G John Gabbana. Fat boy SSC. Now he's just fat boy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Lil Terrio. You remind me of them type of people. Even 6ix9ine. Everybody had their moments. I'm here to stay. You got to do all the shenanigans. And you like old enough to die from old age. Like you like 60 something years old. Like God can literally call your name at any time and it can be natural cause. You natural cause age. And you got one eyeball trying to fight me. So long story short, Sean hit me like, I can get you a bag, man. We're going to put it together. You and Charleston White should fight. I'm like, cool. I'm with it. After they seen the day rough and fight, they like, man, they feel like Charleston White could take me. I want trying to see him anyway. I'm going to smack that. Charleston White is a goofy. I'm going to beat him up for all the reals. I'm going to go up off him. So I'm like, cool, I'll take $100,000. They put the word in, they ain't got 100, they got 50. I'm like, all right, cool, I'll take the 50 because I beat Charleston White to come with the promotion and all that's cool. They like, we send the contract right now. Like, as soon as I agree to the 50,000, they send the contract right now, contract came through, boom. The contract come through, I read it. Long story short, the contract had 40,000 in it on the day of the fight, 10,000 after the fight. And the fight next month, the end of next month. So basically, it's a month and a half a time with no money. Like Basically, they're going to put me and Charleston White on the fight. They're going to make money off the fight and pay me and Charleston White out the money that they raised off our name. And <laughs> Jiggy promoters. Man, I don't know who I did as well as y'all. They don't even have no money to start a fight. They really just trying to get names on the fight to raise the money, to get on the money out of it. Imagine if the fight don't happen, they run off with the whole bag. <laughs> I don't even know y'all to trust y'all to owe me $50,000. i am just saying I do business. I would like a deposit up front, at least have deposit up front, and I would do everything that I'm supposed to do according to the contract. Anything other than that is like highway robbery. I can put myself on the fly with Charleston White right now, sell tickets, and make, make me some money. <laughs> like, who can't do that? It's Aunt Glizzy and Charleston White. A little jinky promoter. So I turned the contract down, y'all. Nobody can owe me 50 k I'm sorry. I can't stop my YouTube channel. I got to go train the gym. Can't talk to my fans. I'm My business. I'm losing all my money. I'm taking off my jobs to go hopefully wish a fight to go on. What if it don't go on? It's like, ain't no security for me. I don't get no money. I never heard of nothing without a deposit. This is for anybody trying to book me for anything. You don't even got to hit me up without a deposit. I think Charleston White was scared anyway. I smacked the shot. Charleston White goofy. Bob or something. I bet you won't ever slap me to live to tell about it. My right hand to God, I swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help me, God, if you ever get a chance to slap me, you won't ever get to tell nobody about it. I promise. No, no, somebody else will have to tell the story. Yeah, man, Aunt Glizzy walked up and slapped that nigga Charleston, and he died. My medical records say I'm homicidal and suicidal by ideation and preparation. Make me go back to the crazy hospital, nigga. Send me back to the crazy hospital because I done stabbed one of you niggas in an episode. Yeah, yeah, make me go back in. Ain't going to keep me number seven days. Shoot. No. That move stabilizing medicine. That's all they going to do. But I'm going to stab your ass up. F with me. You niggas keep thinking I'm just some old nigga you can walk up to it. I ain't your uncles. Now, I ain't them dope fiend crack smoking drunk wine or uncles you niggas got been jumping on kicking their ass. I'm a dang nigga and I keep walking away unscathed. Every situation I'm in, I keep walking away unscathed. Slap me and boy, it's gonna be pokey, 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 pokey. I'm gonna poke 
in so many goddamn places. Boy, please, I'm gonna make you scream and holler. Hold on, I ain't through. Hold on, I ain't through. You, so you gonna slap me, huh? That's just one. So you gotta get through this. Hold on, listen. When I see you coming, I'm gonna already do this. And I travel with this. I check this in on the plane. I check this in on the plane. <laughs> yeah, you bad. You, you gonna slap who? Oh, boy, I'm gonna make your mama cry. I'm gonna make that cry at Glizzy. You ain't a nigga that's bad enough to snap no man. It ain't a rapper goddamn me rapping that's known for slapping nobody. What made, when he rapping niggas start slapping niggas? When, no, 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 no. Hold on, that's just, that's just, that's just two items. Hold on. I ain't through with you. Young punk. Young punk. Talking about what she gonna do to me. I ain't through with you. I got some more goddamn weapons in here for your this little old bitty can of mace right here, this more deadly than the rest of them. This little old bitty can of mace get through the metal detector and everything. Boy, you come on, f with me if you want to, hold on. And I ain't even showed you the gun. See, I'm a law-abiding citizen that can legally carry in most states. <laughs> Die if you want to trying to slap a blind disabled man, rapping d Yeah, f Aunt Glizzy, nigga. You talk about kids, nigga. So come take one for the team. I can't wait for a nigga to take one for the team. I'm ready to get. I'm ready to make a nigga take one for the team too, cause he gonna take one. I travel with this bag right here. Yeah, this my traveling bag. Now, now what's yeah? I can't wait till you come up and slap me. Let me show you what you gotta get through. This here go catch y'all way over there. Let me show you what you gotta get through. Bad. Yeah, these niggas really think they bad. Let me show you what, nigga, let me show your bad ass. Why you, what, how, how, how you gonna slap me and I'm walking around? How you gonna slap me? Read what that said. Pepper blaster. Nigga, how you gonna slap me? That will shoot at it 13 feet, 112 miles per hour. How you gonna slap me? Nigga, read what it says. It says, it's not pepper spray. This is superior. Less lethal protection that shoots a concentrated jet of OC solutions out to 13 feet at 112 miles per hour. How you gonna slap me, nigga? How you gonna slap, nigga? How, how you, to, now tell, to tell us how you gonna slap me. How you gonna slap a nigga walking around with this kind of shit? Huh? Look, look at them two things. 112 miles per hour coming at your How you go slap me, nigga? Look what that says. 112 miles per hour, 13 feet. It got all kind of warnings on it to let you know you in trouble with me. How you go slap me, rapping niggas? Y'all niggas need to quit telling these fairy tale ass stories. I'm sick of you rapping niggas thinking y'all super. Ain't none of you niggas ever proved to be nothing. Nipsey Hussle talk got killed. King Von talk got killed. Ain't none of you niggas ever slap now, nigga. And you ain't now. Name me a rapping nigga that done killed somebody while he rapping. Name me a rapping nigga that threw away his rap career. I don't give a damn about going to jail. And then when them niggas go to jail, they be crying about they got slipped. They got young thug on 23 hour lockdown. It's inhumane. They got, they got, they got young thug on 23 hours. Them niggas go to crime. Hey, hey, we, hey, can I get a bald head? Can I get a, say, gonna come, say, gonna, gonna coming for a fourth bond here. Young, I just want to get out of jail, Yana. Yana, listen, they found out I wasn't violent like the rest of them with the gun. Yana, I'm just, I'm young gunner. I was rapping about pushing P. I wasn't talking about killing them niggas. I wasn't talking about killing Yana. I was talking about pushing P. Can I just get a bond, please? Them niggas talk all that tough. I, I, I ain't got no fella. Well, you gonna die, nigga. Hell or jail? So since I ain't got the sense of sense, you say you go get you an easy, I'm going to you, nigga. Yeah, yeah, you go slap me, I'm going to you. I swear to God, I put that on my children. Yeah, 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 nigga, you slap me. I smacked the shot of Charles Dwayne, goofy, bothersome.